Hi everybody, welcome back to Bimal Sarji YouTube channel. Now I am going to solve 12D OPT mathematics problem. If B, G and C are the number of degree, grades and radians of an angle, prove that G by 200 is equal to C by pi is equal to D by 180. So for this, now we can write here from here solution okay d is equal to d is equal to what is the d the number of okay the number of degree so d is equal to number of degree number of degree g is equal to number of the number of grades Number of grades and this C is equal to number of radians. Radians. Now we know. We have two relation, okay? 180 degree is equal to 200 grade is equal to pi radian, okay? So in the first case, I will take first and second relation. That is, we know 180 degree is equal to 200. And it will be easy to take what? 180 and pi, okay? I will take the first and last, okay? And in the second, I will take this, okay? So first, last, 180 degrees is equal to pi radian. Now, 1 degree, pi by 180 radian. Implies so one degree is equal to pi by 180 radian. That means for d degree, d degree is equal to what? You should multiply d with this. Okay, so d pi by 180 radian. Now from by question, what do you know? By question, by question, D degree is equal to C radian. D degree is equal to C radian. This is the given condition. Because if D, G and C are the number of degree grades and radius of an angle, of an angle means one angle. Okay, suppose there is one angle, okay? The conversion, degree conversion of that angle is equal to the radian conversion, okay? So now we can write this. Now D degree means this is degree, so this will be degree, okay? D degree is equal to this much. So in place of D degree, we will write here D pi by 118. Radian is equal to C radian. Both are radian radian, so we can write here. Implies D pi by 180 is equal to C. So we can write therefore D by 180 is equal to C by this pi will shift from left side to right side. So this is multiply from then it will be what? divide from okay denote the parts so we got this d180 b180 is equal to c by pi okay we got this relation so we can suppose this one okay in the same way side by side i will solve this part okay right. Here. 
We know again, okay, again we know. Again. We know. We have taken one eighty degrees called first and last. Here we take second and last. So there is two hundred red is equal to pi radian. This implies one red is equal to pi by two hundred. Radian implies one grade, so G grade. G grade is equal to when we multiply this one with G, this will be one into G G, and again we should multiply this side, so G pi is equal to G pi by two hundred radian. Now in the same way by question again. Okay? By question G grade, okay. G grade is equal to C radian. This implies. Hey, hey, the time. Have question. Ti mere lai. Hey, le by the question. Ti mere halal na karala. By question G grade is equal to C radian. So now here. G grade equal to much here. G grade is equal to here. G pi by 200. This is G grade equal this much. So we we'll write here. This equal to C radian. Both are radian radian. That means we can write here. This implies what? G pi by 200 is equal to C. Therefore, G by 200 is equal to C by this pi will come. This side, so this will be pi here. This is equation two. Okay. Now from one and two, from one. Okay, from one and two. Here we have c pi is equal to d by 180, and again here is c pi is equal to d by 200. Okay, both are same. So we can write here that this is equal to this is equal to this. Okay, we can write here. So first I will take what we can see from there also. Okay, what is this? G c pi c by pi is equal to d by 200. So we can write here from one and two. What is this? G by 200 is equal to c pi. G by 200 is equal to C pi, so I will write here C pi. Again, this C pi is equal to what? This C pi is equal to what? D by 180, so we can write here D by 180. So this is our G by 200 is equal to C by pi is equal to D by 180. So this is our required solution. Proof. Uh, hope you understood these solutions. If you have any queries, please feel free to comment in the comment box. And in Vimal Sarji YouTube channel, we can find, you can search Vimal Sarji 20 element, Vimal Sarji 118 element, Vimal Sarji short speech, Vimal Sarji prime numbers, Vimal Sarji province, Vimal Sarji GK, Vimal Sarji Bal Viva, and many more videos. In the playlist, uh, up to 12th class. The videos of maths have been already uploaded in my Vimal Sarji YouTube channel. You can go and visit and see the class 10, 9, and below class science math tricks. And to get the updates of my newly uploaded videos, you can subscribe to Vimal Sarji YouTube channel so that you not miss any. वीडियोस सी इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियोस राधे राधे जय श्री कृष्णा